Hello and welcome to the React Native course by Eduonix. In this course we'll be taking a dive into React Native, which is a framework that enables us to build world-class application experiences on native platforms. So that's the official definition, but what React Native allows us to do is to build iOS and Android applications using just JavaScript and the React UI library. So no Objective-C or Swift or Java skills needed, just JavaScript. So before we get started, let me just tell you a little bit about myself. My name is Brad Traversy. I have uh, around 12 years in full stack web development, uh, four to five years of teaching technology courses like this one. I specialize in both front end and server side web development. And I have a bunch of other courses at edgeonix.com if you're interested. All right, so let's look at what we'll learn in this course. So first things first, we're going to take a look at the basic concepts of React. All right, even if you've never used the library before, we're going to go over what it is. Uh, we're even going to set up a very basic application and component in regular React before we even touch React Native. All right, then we're going to get into React Native. We're going to talk about what it is. Uh, we're going to get it set up in both Windows for Android development and in OS X for iOS development. All right, and I should mention that this course is for people using Windows or Mac. All right, so we're going to look at dozens of different React Native components. So things like toolbars, buttons, form controls, and much more. We're also going to look into the API to work with the camera roll. We're going to work with uh, storage in the device, messaging, and more. Uh, we'll put together a couple simple applications, including a to-do list using the device asynchronous storage, as well as a subreddit app using the Reddit API. All right, and we're going to run those in the emulator on both Windows and on a Mac. So here's a list of the different sections. So section one, we're going to look at the basic React concepts. Section two, we're going to get started with React Native. Like I said, we're going to talk about what it is. We're going to install it on both platforms. Section three, we're going to look at different components and input controls, including text input, sliders, pickers, things like that. Uh, section four will be on styling and touch events. Okay, so we have different components for touch events uh, that we'll look at that are compatible on Android and iOS. Then we'll look at UI and navigation. Then we'll start looking at the API, including asynchronous storage, uh, the messaging system, things like that. Section 7 will be our mobile to-dos project. We'll be building this in Windows and testing it on Android, but it's also compatible with iOS and Mac. And then our subreddits project will be building on a Mac, but is also compatible with Windows and Android. All right, so everything is cross-platform, so you don't have to worry about which system you have. Most of the development will be done in Windows, but you can do the same exact thing whether you're on either system. All right, so that's it. Let's go ahead and get started, and I will see you in the first section.